Welcome back to Filling the Void, picking up where we left off after our weekend of crazy pulls. I mean, just crazy pulls. Um, we now officially have a set of six star food ready to go. I am hanging on to it for the time being. I've also started to get these three on their way up. So, um, yeah, lots of work to do, lots of food to make, but we're we're working on making it happen. So. I'm not I'm not sure who I want a six star right away. I'm actually not sure at the moment. So we're we're going to uh, just wing it. I mean, they're all going to get six starred pretty soon anyway, so it's not really a huge deal. But I, I reckon for the sake of the fact that I need to bang out some food, perhaps it should be Bellower because then that'll speed up my farming a little bit. Um, but Bellower, Reliquary, Tender... And Broadmaw are definitely my next three. Gear Grinder is probably not too far behind. Again, unless something else changes by then. But we've got we've got several champs we want to six star. And then, like I said, we do still want to play around with Hollow and uh, like we we have some other stuff that we want to work on. So it would be great if we could just like accidentally get about forty five star chickens. That would be cool if if like. If the game could glitch out or something and just give us a bunch of chickens like that, I'd be, I'd be pretty stoked about that. I need to finish my dailies real quick. The uh, the new season of Path of Exile is live, and we've been grinding. So <laughs> I didn't get as much done. So I got a pretty good amount done, but I didn't get as much done as I wanted to get done over the weekend. So <sighs> I reckon... Yeah, I, I think I think Bellower. I think it makes sense to do Bellower next because even if we can't get him one shot in waves right away, I, I think he'll almost certainly still be able to do it faster than uh, Obero. So that'll speed up the, the farming process a bit, and then yeah, we'll be good. So I think if I can stay in gold, by the way, let me do this real quick doesn't really matter I think if I can stay in gold again I'll finish that challenge I'm pretty sure I have a challenge that's stay in gold for two ranking periods yeah so if I can stay in gold again because I'm pretty sure I was in gold last time then we should knock that out so maybe I need to come here and try to get a few wins Maybe they'll just cleave it down. Maybe they'll just cleave it down. Wow, I did not think we were going to get outsped. I guess it didn't matter, but... um, Anything winnable? Look at, the, look at them already having a bunch of red stars and stuff. I don't know. I don't know what kind of gear to expect them to have. I don't know why they're not running a Katoon lead. I guess they're really trying to keep him alive. He's the only threat. Uh, I feel like if I can't get him out of there quick, it's going to be a problem. So we'll skip it. We also have, if I'm not mistaken, we have a Reliquary Tender Soul. I don't, I guess I don't have a Bellower Soul. I do have one for Reliquary Tender. So we can go ahead and awaken her. Maybe I passed up on a Bellower Soul in the shop. I thought I saw one recently. I guess we'll keep an eye out. Okay, so yeah, I mean, honestly, I don't, I don't think there's another Void Shard we can get our hands on. We are up to 70 in here. We just can't do it, though. It, it's like it's not even close. <laughs> um, maybe after Reliquary Tender's built, we can come in here and, and knock it out. But without a cleanse, we struggle really bad in here. We can get to the boss fine. And then when the boss gets a turn, it's just over. So uh, not, even, not even close to being able to do that yet. As far as everything else goes, still pretty comfortably three key in clan boss most days. 
Gonna try to stay in gold, faction wars. Not a ton to be done right now, honestly. So it's really just food. It's really just like grind out a bunch of food. How are we doing here? There's the six star food. Uh, she can be unlocked. And then what do I have in my vault? Yeah, we're gonna we're not gonna feed him. So again, just nonsense. Okay. So maybe what we'll do then is we'll throw. I hate I hate it when it gets uneven. I'm probably gonna match these three guys. Then maybe I'll throw a Bellower in and start leveling up food with Bellower. Um. And I can I don't I don't see any reason. Because again, I can probably make the food to get him five starred today. And then it's just a matter of getting him to level 50 so I can six star him. I don't see any reason he can't be six starred within a couple of days. I would say by tomorrow, but I know that this evening I'm going to play Path of Exile, which means I'm not going to be focusing on raid as hard. So <laughs> maybe he won't get six starred tonight. But it, within the next couple of days for sure. And maybe maybe I'll have a good protect day. We'll, we'll try to RSL help her in a bit. And, um, and I'll probably burn some gems because I am kind of in a hurry and we're sitting on a decent pile of gems right now. So I think I can justify it. I think there's a fusion coming up, which this one would be, this one would be a classic. I haven't looked at the details. I just saw that there was one coming. I would assume it would be a classic. Right? I don't remember. I don't remember. Either way, um, maybe maybe there will be a void champ that's a part of it. That'd be pretty cool. Um, get another epic added to the squad, potentially. If it's not a classic, and also there's no guarantee it's a void. They don't always do a void, right? It could be four spirit champs, you know what I mean? So we'll see. We'll see what happens. If nothing else, maybe we can get a couple of easy chickens. Maybe. Maybe there will be a void rare in it, perhaps. I don't know. We'll see. Either way, we've got plenty to do. And honestly, plenty of progress to be made now. Like we, we, we some doors have opened. And our Ogren faction crypt is going to be in pretty good shape. We've got a reviver. We've got AOE. We've, we've got some stuff going on in Ogren now. So there's a lot to be done. We possibly... We could possibly get through Spider-14 now. Getting Reliquary Tender and Bellower in the mix. I gotta figure out how I wanna build him. I have to build him like a farmer for now, I think. But it would be really nice to get him in a stun set, I think at some point. That would be that would be handy for a lot of content. If I could get him in a stun set where he could also hit hard, that would be super dope. I don't think I have any stun gear right now though. If I do, I'm very limited. Pretty nice chest. Unfortunate. It's really unfortunate that that attack and accuracy aren't swapped. I actually have some decent pieces. I just don't have much of it. So we would need to farm it. Still no banner for her. Isn't that crazy, dude? yeah not a not a ton to talk about really we're really just gonna be grinding food that, that's really all we got going on we managed to get the at, at least one star from a thrala so when we get her we'll be able to put a blessing on her that'll be nice i don't know how much more we'll do here um and then yeah i guess it's just a matter of waiting and seeing what 
we're gonna have going on for for this fusion if there's gonna be a void rare slash epic in there that's gonna be interesting to us so that'll be exciting but either way plenty to do I'm gonna get to it just grind out a bunch of food I need to pop an XP boost which I thought I had one live already but uh, I don't so we'll pop this three-day boost and really get the most out of it next time you see me I should have a lot less gems <laughs> so a uh, shorter video today again just kind of an update We'll be back soon, hopefully with some pretty significant improvements though. So I'll see you guys later.